Welcome to this video tutorial on the topic of global versus local restoration parameters. This video will show you where to set the global and local restoration parameters and how they relate to each other when creating a single tooth restoration. We are in the design phase of a single tooth restoration and will first look at where the global restoration parameters can be found. Click on the orange colored arrow at the top left to open the system menu. Next, click on configuration and select the parameters option. The parameters menu is structured by restoration type and you can define the settings for each restoration type separately. For our example, we will open the settings for a crown. The restoration parameters found here are referred to as global parameters. The initial suggestion of a crown restoration is calculated based on the parameters specified here. The parameters of the factory settings cannot be changed. However, you have the option to configure individual parameter profiles and later select them for certain restorations when required. To illustrate this, we have created a profile for a strong proximal contact strength as well as for a strong occlusal contact strength. In order to show the difference between the various profiles later on, we have saved the proximal strong profile with a maximum proximal contact strength. The occlusal strong profile has been saved accordingly with a maximum value for the occlusal contact strength. The profile marked with an asterisk is the master profile. In this case, it contains the factory settings. Let's leave the global parameter settings area to return to our single tooth restoration. The restoration has been calculated based on the factory settings. In the step menu of the CEREC software 4.5, only the phases are initially shown, in this case model and manufacture. By clicking on the small symbol on the left, however, all available steps can be shown and selected. The previously selected display is stored in the CEREC software and is automatically displayed in full for the next patient case. We can now access the restoration parameters for the current single tooth restoration. Parameters set here are local restoration parameters, which only apply to this specific case and do not influence the global parameters. For example, let's change the setting for the proximal contact strength. After confirming the entry, the CEREC software calculates a new restoration suggestion. This is also the case if you change the local parameters for the occlusal contact strength, the dynamic contact strength, or the locked setting for the margin thickness. It is therefore important that any changes to the local restoration parameters be made before revising the initial suggestion, as otherwise the adjustments made using the various tools will be lost. Let's now check the result by returning to Edit Restoration. To see the proximal contact strength better, we significantly reduce the visibility of the remaining teeth in the lower jaw. The deep penetration of the proximal contacts is clearly visible. Let's suppose that you want to use one of your previously created profiles for this restoration. To do this, we need to close the Display Objects area and go back to the Restoration Parameters in the Step menu. The individually created profiles are shown by activating the checkbox under Presets. Let's select the Occlusal Strong profile. After confirming our selection, the CEREC software calculates a new restoration suggestion.
The areas colored from blue through green to red show clear penetration of the occlusal contacts to the antagonist. The profiles selected in the design phase only relate to the current restoration and are not applied for subsequent patients or cases. You can, of course, revert to another individually created profile or the factory settings and calculate a new restoration suggestion. We will proceed by selecting the factory settings and confirming our entry again. The restoration has been recalculated based on the parameters for the factory settings, thus eliminating the deep occlusal penetration. Thank you very much for your attention. We would like to wish you every success when working with CEREC.